In biological classification, class Latin, classis, is a taxonomic rank, as well as a taxonomic unit, a taxon, in that rank. Other well-known ranks in descending order of size are life, domain, kingdom, phylum, order, family, genus, and species, with class fitting between phylum and order. As for the other well-known ranks, there is the option of an immediately lower rank, indicated by the prefix sub, subclass Latin, subclasses. For example, dogs are in the class Mammalia. The composition of each class is determined by a taxonomist. Often there is no exact agreement, with different taxonomists taking different positions. There are no hard rules that a taxonomist needs to follow in describing a class, but for well-known animals there is likely to be consensus. In botany, classes are now rarely discussed. Since the first publication of the APG system in 1998, which proposed a taxonomy of the flowering plants up to the level of orders, many sources have preferred to treat ranks higher than orders as informal clades. Where formal ranks have been assigned, the ranks have been reduced to a very much lower level, e.g. class Equisitopsida for the land plants, with the major divisions within the class assigned to subclasses and superorders. Hierarchy of ranks For some clades, a number of alternative classifications are used. An example from zoology History of the concept The class is a distinct rank of biological classification having its own distinctive name and not just called a top-level genus genus summum was first introduced by the French botanist Joseph Pitton de Tournefort in his classification of plants that appeared in his Elements de Botanique, 1694. In the first edition of his Systema Natura, 1735. Carl Linnaeus divided all three of his kingdoms of nature minerals, plants, and animals into classes. Only in the animal kingdom are Linnaeus's classes similar to the classes used today. His classes and orders of plants were never intended to represent natural groups, but rather to provide a convenient, artificial key, according to his Systema Sexuale, largely based on the arrangement of flowers. The class was considered the highest level of the taxonomic hierarchy until George Cuvier's embranchements, first called phyla by Ernst Haeckel, were introduced in the early 19th century. See also Cladistics List of animal classes Phylogenetics Systematics Taxonomy Notes References, <references>